It was the 100th playing of the Investors Group Ontario Women's Amateur Championship, July 7th to the 10th, from the St. Thomas Golf and Country Club. The tournament started with 91 players all looking to win the Marlene Stewart Street Trophy. Well, when we were told that we got it, the, uh, the club was excited. It's that kind of club. Everybody gets so involved here. and um, So it means a lot for a club like ours in a smaller city to have a major event like this. We ended up with 100 volunteers working on it. And, uh, they're loving it. They're loving being a part of it. I think that's very reflective of this club and the people that. Well, you know, we worked right up to the minute to get the uh, thing going. And then the excitement of the first day, the practice round day, we thought would be hectic. But it went extremely well. And the dinner that the GAO put on on Monday night was superb. The excitement grew, I think. After the first round, Mono's Brittany Marchand, the 2012 champion, took the lead with a 3 under 69. Just one shot back was five time champion Aurora's Marianne Hayward at 2 under. Also in contention were Victoria, British Columbia's Naomi Ko and Thornhill's Elizabeth Tong, who were both at 1 under. After a 4 under second round, Ko assumed the lead at 6 under. Meanwhile, Marchand and Tong moved into a tie for second spot at 2 under. Also in contention was Texas native and dual citizen Maddie Zarek, who sat just three off the lead at one under. Marchant managed to regain the lead after a three under third round to move to five under for the tournament. Right on her heels though was Zarek, who shot another round of two under and was just two back. As for Ko, she slipped to two under by the end of the day, but still found herself in the last group for the final round. Marchand would struggle during the final round, finishing one over, opening the door for Zarek. Zarek fired a 4-under final round, which was enough to win her the championship by three shots at 7-under for the tournament. Marchand and Co. shared the silver medal at 4-under. It's a pretty big honor to win the 100th one. That's amazing. Um, I just kind of came into this tournament hoping to play well, not really sure what would happen. The past few days, I played like one over on the front nine, so it was a little unexpected, but I think I was more focused on each shot than where I was relative to Brittany and Naomi. I was just playing my plan. Obviously, it's a huge tournament and it, it would mean so much to win. It's always great to win near home. And I mean, my family grew up here. Everyone is from London. And so it's awesome to win close to home. I haven't won in a while, so it's nice to win again and just have that uh, confidence.